Hey everyone, welcome back to another Terraria video. Today, we are checking out what Terraria Boomerang should have been thanks to the Boomerang Plus mod, and we have another little mod in here. No spoilers though, no spoilers. We'll see what that other mod is at the end. But let us start this video by checking out how many Boomerangs there is in vanilla Terraria now. There is a bit more thanks to 1.4, but since we're in 1.3 Team Mod Loader, obviously we don't have all the new stuff. But as you can see, there's a good bit of Boomerangs. And at the same time, there's not really. Uh, mainly because you go like this those are seasonal boomerangs of course so you kind of got to take them out at least for 1.4 you can craft an enchanted boomerang now uh but then let's say you know rng comes into play boom get rid of that <laughs> And then everything else seems pretty doable. You could probably get your hands on these, even though a bunch of these do also take a lot of RNG to get. But yeah, this is pretty much what you're looking at. Even if you're including like the Sergeant United shield, that's also RNG. I think I've seen that from the traveling merchant like once ever in my time of playing 1.4, which isn't even that much time. So maybe that's a good thing. But yeah, there's not too many boomerangs in vanilla Terraria, but at the same time, there's a good bit. There honestly is a good bit at the same time. But today, thanks to the boomerang plus mod, as you can see this is the pre-hard mode chest we already got a bunch and then we look over here this is the hard mode chest we already got a bunch more yeah let us get to it we're not checking out recipes today we are just throwing boomerangs slinging throwing lobbing yeeting whatever you want to say we're doing that with boomerangs let's get to it starting with the glass boomerang let us spawn in an enemy and let's see the damage honestly not bad am i wearing an armor set i don't think i am no we're good not too bad for an early boomerang Boomerangs honestly are really good weapons, especially early. I don't know about late game. I feel like unless they home like the possessed hatchet or unless you could throw a bunch of them, then they could be useful hard mode. But uh, pre hard mode, I definitely feel like they're, they're great weapons. On to the next here, we got the stinger. Poisons enemies for a short period of time. Does it shoot anything out on the throw? It doesn't look like it. Let's see it in action here. I'm assuming the poison is going to be random, if at all. Hello? Now, it's weird to have a, a jungle boomerang because we already have one whether or not it's not an actual boomerang shape it is considered a boomerang the the shock room on to the next we have the mandible boomerang shoots up to two boomerangs at once so you know how you can stack boomerangs like the banana ring and the light disc the ones from this mod i believe you just you just throw multiple at once i don't think they're stackable i just think they let you throw multiple at once and it just says that so that's very nice we're doing more dps we're throwing double the boomerangs of course we're gonna do a lot more damage if we're doing double normal amount of uh, other boomerangs but there you go there's a mandible one not bad on to the wormerang and then obviously after that we got the flesh flesherang which is the variants crimson corruption variants let's see it in action here honestly if it says 17 damage it's it's gonna do good damage this one says 20 like come on it's gonna do good damage that's good early game damage and i'm assuming you probably don't need skills to get these it's the only recipe i'm checking i just i just want to know i just want to know if these don't require scales then it's pretty damn good oh that's pretty damn good next up we have the cerulean like the city in uh pokemon it shines a deep blue color does it do anything else whoa, whoa, whoa this is like our furthest boomerang yet let's go ahead and see it in action here a nice three hitter to take out the skeleton beautiful now boomerangs they are obviously great for single target damage we might see a couple that are good for crowd control we'll, we'll see as we get into the hard mode stuff or maybe these last two will be good let's see next up we got the b rang poisons enemies for a decent amount of time let me see it because our last thing did not poison any enemies but our last two pre hard mode boomerangs here demon's edge and crimson edge let's see it they do great damage this is without armor this is without accessories so they're pretty damn good doing that much damage and uh oh the crit with the crimson one insta killed a skeleton that's crazy but there you go there's all the pre-hard mode boomerangs from this mod and i believe how many do we have we add all these together to this and what's the other new boomerang they added in 1.4 the shroom one the shroomerang which i didn't even know existed until like somewhat recently like that's a good bit of yo-yos right there especially if we wait for team mod 1.4 that's a good bit of yo-yos or why do i keep on saying Yo -yos. moving on to the hard mode ones these ones i'm excited the most for go ahead let's grab a handful here and let's get to testing starting with the balloon orang shoots up to five boomerangs at once look at that i'm just holding left click five of them just like that let's see them in action probably gonna do a lot more damage here oh killing them with the back the return of the boomerang is killing them how often do you see that 
Next up, we got the Spider Ring. Inflicts the Venom debuff. Okay, we might have to change out the statue here to something a little bit stronger. All right, here we go. We switched it to a Nymph. Let's see this in action. Am I throwing multiple or is this a really big boomerang? It's a really big boomerang. This does actually inflict the Venom debuff, as you can see. Maybe it was just the skeleton doesn't take poison. Maybe that's something uh, I wasn't really thinking about. <laughs> It's something that usually doesn't come up often in Terraria, so like my bad for not thinking about it. But as you can see, the poison is doing work. All right, next up we got the Hollowed Boomerang, said to belong to King Arthur's little cousin. Shout out little cuz. Let's see what kind of damage this does. Oh my, that's an 100 crit again. Not wearing any armor, not wearing any accessories. That's crazy. After that, we have the Chlorified Boomerang. Let's see it in action. It's just a Chlorified Boomerang, plain and simple. Fills in an area that I'm assuming doesn't have many boomerangs. I don't know. Let me look right here. You get the, you can get this like pretty much straight out of hard mode or straight into hard mode. Banana Rang, you know, if you get lucky with some spawns, you can get that. A light disc, you obviously got to fight some mechs and then obviously golem and then hope a paladin spawns and drops the hammer. So honestly, it does get a little slim here. Next up, we have the Reaper Boomerang. Fires powerful ghost boomerangs. Let me see it in action. Oh, it shoots a lot. It really does shoot a lot. I didn't even say that. Does it go through enemies? Oh, I wish it went through enemies. It's a ghost boomerang. You feel like it should go through enemies, but I guess that's fine. After that, we have the true hollowed boomerang, which I'm assuming is just a way better hollowed boomerang. Yeah, it looks like it. And then after that is the true demon's edge. And I guess I might as well take out the uh, true crimson edge while we're at it too. Let's see it in action here. Just strong boomerangs. I'm kind of wishing that there was a couple more special effects on them because some of them need some special effects or something. And we have our last set of boomerangs here. Let's go ahead and see in action starting with the terror rang fires powerful boomerangs of light and dark let me see this in action can't really tell which ones are light can't really tell which ones are dark but let us see it in action anyways you throw out a lot of them which is good i guess if there's no special effect what you would want is to be able to throw out a bunch after that we have the ufo shoots homing ufo boomerangs this one sounds like it's gonna be real good homing that's less work for me oh yes Look at that. Now you can pretty much say that I'm killing her on the return, but it's the homing. It's the homing. It just takes a while, but it's definitely homing in. Like if I throw it upwards after that, we have the spooky rang shoots up to 10 boomerangs. This is beautiful. Very short range, but 10 boomerangs to make up for it. And they do good damage. Not bad. I'll take it. After that, we have the Omega. This one looks cool. It doesn't look like your normal boomerang. Let's see it in action here. Looks like a horseshoe. You can throw a lot of it. It makes a different noise. Unique. It's unique to say the least. Let's see it in action here. Okay, great damage. You love to see it. But yeah, last but not least, I said I installed a special mod here. We've seen this in a previous video, I believe, uh, if I'm remembering correctly, and that is the Zenith Rang. Of course, a Zenith slash Zenith boomerang. Let's see it in action here. Oh my god, that was the right click. It has a oh my god. I didn't know it had a right click. I know it has a left click, as you can see, but I did not know it had a right click. Let's see it in action. Of course it's gonna kill that nymph. Let's let's see a different enemy here. Or even a boss, I guess. Let's see a queen bee. And we're gonna use the left click. Yes, sir. Good damage. Let's see the queen bee again. But this time we're using the right click only beautiful but yeah there you go there was what terraria boomerang should have been obviously there's a couple things lacking here and there always i could wish for an armor set and always i could wish for some accessories but my main pet peeve with this mod like i love that it just fills in a bunch of areas that need boomerangs but i do wish that some of them did more or had more effects on them because some of them just feel like very just plain and boring it's just legit a boomerang <laughs> don't be shy to add in a couple of effects this mod hasn't been updated in a while though from what i know so uh we gotta give them some slack there but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure to check out the mod and make sure to leave more suggestions for other classes you want to see overhauled i know we'll get to gun soon because i know people really want to see the guns one but there's a lot of good gun mods out there so that one's kind of hard to narrow down and find just like a singular good gun mod but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed Bye bye have a good one